a very good morning to all my dear students your teacher is back again for today's session today we have got the math session okay before we go ahead let us see what is today's date today's date is please check it on the board 3rd of february and the year is 2021 and which day is today yes today it's wednesday all right now before we go ahead let us count the numbers from 91 to 100 come on let's begin counting 91 92 93 94 95 96 97 98 99 100 lovely good job my dear students and now let us revise the months of the year come on let's begin january february march april may june july august september october november december lovely all right so my dear students today we are going to learn something new okay i'm going to share some picture on the screen please watch it carefully and answer my question okay now here one day a dog saw a bone which was kept high up on the staircase and the staircase are numbered from numbers 1 to 10 10 so he climbs up the stairs he is climbing from number 1 2 3 4 then 5 6 7 then 8 9 at number 10 he gets the bone on the 10th staircase now when he climbs the stairs from 1 to number 10 that is from smallest to biggest number it is called as ascending order okay when we count the numbers from smallest to biggest it is called as ascending order now the dog is very happy he got the bone he takes the bone and now he wants to go back down so how is he going to go okay he will go from biggest to smallest number let us see how he comes down from 10 he comes down to number 9 then 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 and now ha he has reached down so the order of numbers when we come from bigger to smaller that is from the biggest number to the smallest number is called as descending order all right now i am going to share one more example okay now here do you see some children yes they are of different heights Which is the tallest boy we are? Yes. This boy is the tallest boy. And which is the shortest boy we are? Yes, the one with the white shirt. Now, if they want to see the circus, in which order they will stand? So that is easy for them to see the circus. Yes, they will stand according to the heights from smallest to tallest. Okay, so they are going to stand it this way. Okay, and they can see the circus and enjoy it very comfortably. They can see everything if they stand in this order. But after finishing the circus, they come out and they see a naughty boy coming to them. They are scared of the boys. So if they stand from smallest. to the tallest height from shortest to the tallest height can they hide themselves from the boy no so in which position they'll stand so that they are not seen by that 
naughty boy yes we are going to stand in this position from tallest to the shortest so my dear students yes when we arrange the objects from smallest to biggest it is called as ascending order and when we arrange the objects from biggest to smallest it is called as descending order i hope you have understood the concept of ascending and descending order now it's time to do something in our math textbook yes please open page number 6767 of your math textbook write today's date and say it up now here we need to number the objects from smallest to biggest so are you ready my dear students yes here you can see fishes of different sizes so which is the smallest fish over here yes the second one okay so we we'll write the number 1 over there we are going to number them okay which is a fish which is little bigger than this one yes here we we'll write number 2 then a little more bigger yes here we we'll write number 3 and which is the biggest fish over here yes here we we'll write number 4 good job let's move to the ducks which is the smallest and tiny duck over here Yes, the last one. Here we we'll write number one. A little more bigger than that. Yes, the first one. We we'll write number two over there. A little more bigger. Yes, write number three over here. And biggest duck. Yes, write number four. Yes, which is the smallest tree over here? Yes, the last one. So please write number one. Which is the Yes, a little more bigger than that. Yes, you're right. Absolutely right. Right, number two. Then a little bigger. Yes, number three. And the biggest tree. Yes, number four. Good job, my dear students. And now please turn your page. Come on, page number six eight sixty eight. Here we need to number the objects. Yes, from one to four. From biggest. to smallest from biggest to smallest okay the first picture as you can see which is the biggest lion we are yes please write number 1 over there a little smaller than that yes the first one so write number 2 a little more smaller than that yes you're right number 3 and the smallest lion yes write number 4 let's move to the elephant which is the biggest elephant we are yes please write number 1 a little smaller than that yes number 2 a little more smaller you are right number 3 and the smallest yes you are right the last one right number 4 yes this last picture you are going to do it on your own i am waiting for you i hope you are done with the worksheet that's it that is all for class for today and for your homework you need to open your math workbook that's right you need to complete page number 46 and page number 47 for your